I voted for Ronald Reagan when I was five. My father taught me the important lessons early. On Tuesday, November 6, 1984, the lesson my father taught me was that I should care what goes on around me because it affects me and I can do something about it. I don't remember anything my father said that day. And I wish I could say that he said something eloquent that stuck with me forever. Still, I've never forgotten my father taking me by the hand into the voting booth in my elementary school gymnasium, picking me up so I could see the ballot and showing me which hole to punch. I felt that I had done something important, and when Reagan won, I was proud. My father always said with satisfaction that he voted for Reagan both times. I watched and listened as he yelled at the television screen while George H.W. Bush debated Michael Dukakis in the presidential debate during the 1988 election. I remember him watching the Oliver North trial on C-SPAN in 1989. I watched CNN with him as the United States attacked Iraq in defense of Kuwait in 1990. Twenty-three years later, I wish I had the presence of mind to vote for Walter Mondale. While my father's passion for politics rubbed off on me, I am his polar opposite when it comes to ideology. He is a hardcore conservative. I am as liberal as they come. He cheered when Bush Sr. said, read my lips, no new taxes. I asked, who will pay for the services my government should be providing, and why are those tax breaks only going to the top 1%? He believes in personal responsibility. I believe in caring for the least among us, the sick, the hungry, and the poor. He believes that being gay is a sin, and that God plagued the world with HIV AIDS as a punishment. I believe in equality. He believes that abortion is murder, and the pregnant woman would surely go to hell. I believe in freedom of choice. This I believe above all else. No matter what we believe, we should care. Voters were not reaching in the mid to low thirties in presidential election years. They're even worse in an off year in abysmal in municipal and state elections. France has an 80% voter turnout rate. 80%! How different would this country be if we voted like the French?